World Career Events' third generation ended only at the beginning of this year. But the car officially left our market much earlier and it is a rare guest on the secondary market. So is it worth looking for? In terms of practicality, a large, comfortable and roomy station wagon looks very attractive. But sedans have always been in favor with us. Besides, for the new Avensis officially sold in Russia, the surcharge for a more comfortable body was about $1,500. Therefore, today in the secondary market, cars are a rarity. There are among them Europeans with capricious diesel engines, which we would not recommend buying. Initially, in the Russian arsenal of Avensis there were three gasoline engines, 1.6L, 132 horsepower, 1.8L, 147 horsepower, and 2.0L, 152 horsepower. After restyling in the fall of 2011 year left only 1.8. On more affordable versions, it is combined with a six-speed manual box in more expensive trim levels. With the CBT, modifications with diesel engines were not officially delivered to us, and the rarest specimens with units of the 1AD, 2.0L, and 2AD, 2.2L, series were imported from European countries exclusively by private order. Western aliens have only one body type, station wagon. Such an offer looks nice and practical, but diesel in this case is not at all something worth fighting for. High oil consumption and, as a result, strong carbon formation, up to hard deposits on the pistons that require their replacement, regular cleaning, every 20 to 30,000 kilometers, of the exhaust gas recirculation, EGR, valve. And this is only part of the possible problems. In Europe, Failed fuel injectors, injection pumps and defective cylinder head gaskets were replaced under warranty. By the time of the first restyling, most of the birth defects had been eliminated, but cases of oxidation of the aluminum cylinder block at the point of contact with the cylinder head gasket, followed by loss of mechanical seals, were also recorded on younger cars. It makes sense to protect yourself from such risks and look for something gasoline in your native open spaces. Yes, the design of naturally aspirated, force of the ZR series also does not require a major overhaul. But the purchase of a new short block will most likely not be needed before 350 to 400,000 kilometers. The average resource of the timing chain is 250,000. It is possible that during this interval it will be necessary to change the cooling system pump three times, 2,500 rubles for a high-quality non-original. Nevertheless, if the compression in the cylinders is normal, and the diagnostics of the control unit did not detect critical errors, the gasoline engine will still serve you decently. Another node that needs attention is the variator. Under the conditions of normal operation of the car, without sudden starts, slippage, and with regular replacement of the transmission fluid, the service life of the CVT is 250 to 270,000 kilometers. You can't fix it cheap and fast. A new one costs around 400,000 rubles, restored, 250,000. A manual box is a less risky asset. It tends to howl at different speeds, but this is not considered a malfunction, and the engineers solved the problem with the difficulty of engaging the gears of pre-styling machines by replacing the release bearing and finalizing the box itself. The new guides help take the edge off the rattling front brake calipers. The most common cause of knocks in the front suspension is the surrendered stabilizer struts. They have to be changed about once every 50,000 kilometers. At the same time, Silent blocks of levers, thrust bearings and shock absorbers can easily withstand twice as long runs. The leatherette upholstery of the seats and the braid of the steering wheel lose their presentable appearance in a couple of years. Scuffs on the windshield and clouded chrome decorative trims can also become a reason for bargaining during inspection. But don't expect a big discount. By today's standards, Toyota Avensis is an almost trouble-free car and, with proper care, does not require large expenses for treatment for a long time. But finding an untortured copy is not an easy task. Transmission. Transmission slippage, jerks when picking up speed are a serious reason to abandon the variator. Replacing a faulty node with a restored one will cost at least 250,000 rubles. A new one costs a third more. The mechanics have problems with shifting gears and howling in different modes. The first defect was successfully cured, the second is not considered a malfunction. In general, the MCP can be considered reliable. Engine. Diesels are distinguished by a fair oil burn and, as a consequence, strong soot formation. There is a risk of getting to replace an expensive high-pressure fuel pump and injectors. Gasoline fours are less capricious. 
except for the liquid cooling pumps that die every 60 to 80,000 kilometers. The ZR series engines do not require special attention to their person. Their timing chains go up to 250,000, and piston blocks and parts up to 400. Suspension. The front suspension of the Avensis uses McPherson struts, and the rear is double wishbones. The design is simple and reliable. Shock absorbers and silent blocks of levers can withstand 100 to 120,000 kilometers each. And the front stabilizer struts that require replacement every 45 to 60,000 will definitely not ruin you. On cars of the first years of production, it happened that the front springs burst. They were replaced under warranty, and soon the factory began to install parts with a new article number. Body. In general, a Vensis iron does not tend to rust. Small blisters can be found on the windshield pillars of older specimens, but this is not a general phenomenon. It is worth paying attention to the front doors. Some owners complained that with the onset of severe cold, the lower edges clung to the sills. In addition, at the ends, in the area of backslash U200B backslash U200 fastening the limiter, there may be metal brakes, design flaw. Electrician. Flashing lamps on the instrument panel for malfunctions of the parking brake and the VSC dynamic stabilization system are characteristic glitches of electricians, which are repeated even after recalibration. On pre-styling copies, the radio sometimes refused to read the CD. Cured. The ability of climate control to direct air flows not where it is ordered, but as it pleases, is a disease characteristic of older cars. Treatment. Block replacement. 42,000 rubles.